repeating my fellow guitar players, I'm Rob Chappers and this is the Hofner Shorty uh, in black, as you can see. Uh, it's such a great, great piece of fun, this guitar. Uh, basically, it's a baseball bat with a humbucker. Best way to sit with the Hofner Shorty is to put the palm of your right hand on top of the bridge and it stays in place now. If you don't, you're going to get a little bit of neck droop. It's just part of the way the guitar works. <laughs> If you were the kind of guy who likes going to festivals, getting drunk, uh, partaking in, in dirty, unsavoury acts, listening to loud music, and then making your own kind of music, this could be the fun item you need to purchase for just 149, 149 Great British Imperial Credits. <laughs> Yes, it's a stick with power. Uh, this thing, when it arrived in the tiny little dwarf box, uh, I kind of thought, what on earth has Alex at the wonderful Barnes & Mullins asked me to review? It took me five minutes to get used to the way you've got to sit and play this thing. And it looks odd and it feels weird because there's a giant part of guitar missing. But then you get over that and you get into the way you've got to sit with it and you get into the sound and it sounds great and you get into the fact that this is incredibly portable and all of a sudden it's a badass piece of gear. It comes in a gig bag, uh, it's available in black, red and there are a few very rare ones in pink if that floats your boat and it may well do. In fact I love it so much that I actually recorded a solo uh, on my EP at arm's reach using the Hofner Shorty because I could reach it with my arms. So the woods are maple, as you can see on the neck. It's got a rosewood fingerboard. This is a mahogany body, so it's all great woods. Um, it's got a really giant, beefy uh, bridge here, locked in place so it cannot move. Giant lump of metal giving some resonant tone. One volume, one tone. Um, I had to get used to them being quite close together, but when you get over that, it's great. A really, really simplistic rock machine. <laughs> If you're looking for a piece of fun, if you're looking for monster tones, because they really are monster tones, uh, from a simplistic travel rock piece of goodness, the Hofner Shorty might just be your guitar. <laughs> Now, just because it's affordable uh, and small doesn't mean that uh, Hofner have skipped on quality or detail because it's really well made. Uh, the fret dressing is perfect. Uh, the neck is lovely and satin smooth. There's no finish on it. The body is finished well. Uh, the hardware and parts are great, you know. For example, even the machine heads are 18 to 1 ratio. Um, you know, you're getting a great, great guitar for very little money at all. And what a guitar. Imagine this something like a Roland uh, micro cube strapped to your back, you could have a lot of fun with that, couldn't you? The neck is a full 24 and 3 quarter scale neck, so it doesn't feel weird to play. It's exactly the same scale length as a Les Paul by the G company. <laughs> is a badass guitar man. Um, like I said, it takes five minutes getting used to, uh, strap it on and run around town with an amplifier and you will just be so surprised at how nice it sounds. How nice? How nice. This humbucker is really good. It's very powerful, it's uh, smooth sounding, it sounds ceramic to me. It's a little bit reminiscent of the Chapman Guitars ML1 humbucker, if any of you guys are familiar with that. Uh, so a lot of power, basically. <laughs> it's a rock 
guitar, it really is. So this is my friend. Friend, what is your name? Uh, my name's Dan. Good boy, Dan. And Dan is very small, as you can see, probably. And I thought, just to show you uh, what the Hofner Shorty is like with a small person, because I am ogre-esque, uh, Dan is going to play a selection of interesting licks and phrases using the Hofner Shorty guitar. By the way, we're going through a Marshall JVM head set to death. Play. <laughs> For something small, black, and 150 pounds, this is your cricket bat. I'm in love with it, I'm not going to send it back. Uh, and I recommend that you do exactly the same. You guys take it easy, chappers out.